start off, I'm taking my Pixi Hydrating Mist and just spraying that all over my face and then going in with my Clinique Moisturizing Lotion, I'm also going to apply that all over my face as well. For primer, I'm using my Rimmel Stay Matte Primer and I'm going to apply that on my face but mainly focusing on the T-zone area because that's where I get oily the most. Here, I'm taking NYX HD Concealer in the shade green and just covering up these annoying zits that literally formed overnight. And then for foundation, I'm going to be using Makeup Forever Ultra Issue Stick in the shade 153Y405. For concealer, I'm using Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Treatment Concealer. I believe this is in the shade Neutralizer. So what I did here was just apply under my eyes, my forehead, the bridge of my nose, and my chin. And then I took my Beauty Blender to blend everything out. For eye primer, I'm using Urban Decay's Eyeshadow Primer Potion in Eden. Here, I'm taking Laura Mysterious Translucent Powder to set everything. So as you can see, I did my eyebrows off camera because they do take me a long time to perfect them. But anyway, here I'm just taking a brush to dust off the powders. For my eyes, I'm going to be using my Modern Renaissance Palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills and to start off, I'm taking burnt orange and blending that on my crease as the transition color. And then going in with this shade right here, I'm also going to blend that on my crease but mainly focusing on the outer corner. Next, going in with Cypress Umber or Umber, I'm also going to apply that to the corner of my eyes as well. Going back with the shade right here, I'm going to blend that onto my crease again to blend everything out so that nothing looks harsh. Taking Max eyeshadow and nylon, I'm just gonna take that and apply it to my brow bone area. To create my Wayne eyeliner, I'm gonna be using this Tarte Tardis Clay Paint Liner. Taking the shade again, I'm gonna blend that on my lower lash line. And then going back with this darker shade right here, I'm also going to blend that on my lower lash line as well. Taking Max eyeshadow and nylon again, I'm going to apply that to the inner corner of my eyes. For my lower lashes, I'm going to be using Laura Telescopic Mascara and Black is Black. For my top lashes, I'm going to be using Maybelline's Push Up Angel Mascara. To contour my face, I'm going to be using Stila Stay All Day Bronzer.
For bronzer, I'm using Wet n Wild's Color Icon Bronzer in SPF 15. To highlight, I'm going to be using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Clay and Gleam. And first off, I'm taking Crush Curls and applying that to my cheekbones, and then going in with Starburst after that. I absolutely love these two mixed together because they just give me like the best highlight ever. <gasps> I just died. Last but not least, to set my makeup, I'm going to spray my face with this Scandinavia Makeup Setting Spray. Before putting on falsies, I'm going to curl my lashes with this Tarte Eyelash Curlers. And then for lashes, I'm using Salon Perfect 614 Black. To line my lips, I'm going to be using MAC's Lip Liner in Strip Down. And then to fill in my lips, I'm going to be using MAC's Lipstick in Naturally Transformed. Lastly, I'm going to be applying on Kylie Jenner's lip gloss in Literally to complete the lips. So yeah, that completes this whole look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys do, please give a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching. Until next time, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!